For the first time in more than 200 years, the Notre Dame Cathedral in Paris will not celebrate Christmas Mass. The 850-year-old building is still being restored after April's devastating fire. As Imachias Taab reports, people are still finding ways to celebrate the holiday. A song of praise tinged with sadness. These singers are part of the Notre Dame choir. Since the Gothic cathedral was devastated by fire back in April, they've been rehearsing at this nearby church. Most are still struggling to accept that Christmas Mass at the iconic cathedral is canceled this year. To think that I was ill last Christmas and I missed Christmas in Notre Dame, thinking that I would go again this year with no problem. And yeah, no, it's, um, yeah, I can't believe I'm not going to do Christmas. The cause of the blaze is still unclear, but what is is that far more than brick and mortar has been affected. This film from 1948 shows the first ever recording of Christmas Mass at Notre Dame, giving us a glimpse of the past that reminds us why the church remains so relevant to so many today. Not even during World War I and II did it close its doors completely. Despite the extensive damage, including the collapse of its roof and spire, the French government is confident services will resume again by 2025. In the grand scheme of things, five or six years of renovation doesn't seem like a huge amount of time for a cathedral that's 855 years old. But reconstruction experts say it'll likely take longer. But for Eduardo Barea, that might not be such a bad thing. People are trying to reconstruct and give everything to rebuild it. And it's maybe the opportunity to go to other churches and to uh, rebuild your faith. Notre Dame will, without a doubt, continue to be a symbol of faith, one that's already rising from the ashes. Infio's Time, CBS News, Paris.